Curtis Quillen caught up with some fans outside of Amelie Arena after the win was officially sealed and the Lady Bears were announced as champions. And uh, Curtis, what do those fans have to say? You know, it was a little stressful for them, Jessica. They filled the seats here all that all night cheering on their Lady Bears. The, it was a great crowd. They were loud and they got quite the show taking this one down to the wire. But at the end of the night, they get to celebrate a national championship with their Baylor Lady Bears. In fact, take a look at this, the bear pit. More excited than anyone I've seen tonight as the Lady Bears cut down the net as national champions for the third time ever. We caught up with with fans outside the arena and here during the celebrations. Students who made the, the bus trip from Waco here to Tampa, Florida. Fans who made the trip. I can't tell you the number of graduates and alumni who made the trip from Central Texas here to the Sunshine State, the West Florida coast to watch their Lady Bears hoist up another national championship trophy, something that is an overwhelmingly emotional experience for all of them. I was amazed. The ending was very close. Everybody was cheering. Everybody was insane. So I started like high-fiving people I didn't know. I started hugging people I didn't know. It was amazing. Oh, it's just exciting. It's awesome because I haven't done it before. So I was glad to make the trip. You know, I can relate to the gentleman from the bear pit. One of the things he, uh, that happened while I was outside waiting on some fans as the game was ending, a Tennessee lady volunteer fan was standing next to me watching the end of this game, and she was clutching my shoulder. I think she bruised it in a couple of spots as she was watching this game because it was such a thriller down on the floor. It was a fantastic game. All of these fans walking out of Amelie Arena tonight, smiling from ear to ear as national champions of women's college basketball.